Hello, this is Marcel Ernie reporting at the Calgary Superbike National, Race City Motorsport Park. Uh, I just finished my first practice session on the 08 bike and uh, it's bumpy out there, even with soft suspension. It, uh, it's just such a horrible track, it's really rough and just so bumpy, it's ridiculous. <laughs> across the world's movie screens with the force of a kung fu kick. The purpose of all his training and self-discipline was to achieve a total fluidity of force so that his body responded directly to a situation, neither consciously attacking nor defending, but feeling and responding. I forgot to take my ibuprofen before going out. It's uh, definitely a mistake that I'm not going to make uh, the next three days. Tomorrow is qualifying and I think I'm going to qualify on the 05. Of course, I haven't tried new tires on the 08 all year, so that might be uh, interesting as well. Shade. Yeah, baby, we were sad.
never saw another creature, never knew another man. Yeah, baby, we were nothing. We existed for less. Our present was empty. Our history a mess. But now we can see. Now we do as we please. Now we do away with our disease. Okay, we're gonna vote to uh, do a drive-through of the track. I'm gonna show you. Race City and uh, talk about how uh, the condition and such. Okay, and then I'll just uh, go through the gears. Let's just enjoy some of the scenery, Marcel, for a minute. <laughs> right. We've got the brake markers. Brake at number three, as hard as you can, drop three gears. Right now, one, two, three. Oh, it didn't get in the gear. Try again. Three. Oh. <laughs> You're braking right into the corner. And then you let slow off down, right slow now. Down, slow down, slow down. And I'm okay, I wanna, for God's sakes. I want to be able to explain the, the track. <laughs> and then you lean over. And now you're right on the curve. My let my right wheel is like, you're right on the curve. Mid track right now. And you cut in. And it's really bouncy. You gotta be one meter wide on that bump right there. Put it here and brake a little bit in. It's really bumpy. I just as tight as you can. And uh, you're gonna feel the bump right about. Oh, there's one. Geez. And there's <laughs> two. Oh, oh. And, and then it bounces on your exit right here, and that's like really bad. It's right corner. Oh, breaking that. bumps right here, you're breaking the bumps. I take it as tight as possible, try to straight line it as much as possible, ride the curb with your knee, accelerate out, try not to go too wide because you got them. You're a full throttle, you're still Slow full down. throttle. And then <laughs> get on your brakes into the corner, right? You brake right yeah. into the corner. Yeah. Don't move the body. Allegedly. Holy Run Jesus. the curb with Whoa. the left wheel. <laughs> Run the curb with your right knee here, and you're on the throttle already, mid-corner. And uh, try not to swing her into the puddle right there. It's a big oh, puddle. Geez. Yeah, you, they're telling <laughs> us about that at the rider's meet. Oh, geez, you guys die there. And then, so you're full throttle and number two. Oh, I didn't now, realize that. Now, brake hard, brake hard. Oh, I didn't realize that was uh, so The brake mark, it gives you an idea where to brake. Oh, yeah, because I don't know, they're trying to kill you. <laughs> <laughs> you run the inside curve, there's a bump right there. Oh, geez, right I, didn't, out. I didn't realize <laughs> and this that. Curve is, I hit that curve, that one's dangerous as hell. Oh, why, and, they, why are they there? And, uh, and it's really bumpy, you just kind of oh, look inside, at inside. Then you, then you floor the throttle right here. <laughs> and why wouldn't you go on the outside? And then you swing her so in. Much you hey, let's trail go around now fast.
<laughs> so I better not say anything controversial here, I'll wind up on YouTube. Uh, okay, so um, all in all, a really good effort and almost beat the penalty on the jump start. Almost? You mean for a second place finish? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I figured I got a jump start there and then it screwed up my start even worse. So I was like seventh in the corner one and I was like, I got to work my way up. And as soon as I finally found second, I just like got to work a gap. I just never gave up and my legs are burning. And I'd like to thank Roy at Pinnacle Physio for helping me out and the World Gym and Falco Leathers and uh, Amsoil, of course, for my train intervals getting extended. Um, it was an unbelievable ride. I, this was the most important race of the year for me, right? I've been preparing for this all year, so I'm just happy to be on the podium and finally get a win on a box. Now, typically here, we get a bit spread out in amateur sport bike, but uh, yeah, and if there is a race, typically you're the guy who's in the middle of it, but this one was, was pretty crazy. There was a lot of action from start to finish. Yeah, definitely, you know, it was, everyone's really tight, we're all within one second, and uh, like qualified six, I was a little disappointed, because I'm like, last year I got second, so I'm like, everybody's just getting faster, these kids just keep getting faster, and I feel like they experienced one now, and that uh, experience played through in the race. Now, tell me, between today and tomorrow, is there anything you think you can change, or anything that will help? Um, just uh, get a better start, and uh, I was going as hard as I could, you know. Nothing else you can really do except for try to get the first and get out there in front. All right, good run. Congratulations. Thank you, Colin. Start your boat. Nice job. Thanks. Good job. Good job as well. Congratulations, man. Thank you. Cool. Thank you for giving me a hard time. No worries, man. It's all good. Yeah, good race. Thanks for your race. Thank you. He's going to be on the third spot. He's still going to be the tallest guy out there. He's the dominator, man. He ran away with it. Fantastic. I mean, uh, the other guys were pretty far away from me, so I just uh, took it easy and win the race. <laughs> yeah, definitely. <laughs> this is some track you got here, though. Oh, I give it a one out of ten, actually. <laughs> it's too bumpy. You've been on real tracks, of course. Yeah, I mean, I've ridden, you know, tracks all over the world, actually. So this is a new experience for me. Have you been to Sepang F1 circuit there in Malaysia? No, I haven't been to Sepang, oh, no. I want to race there. Yeah. One third the price, right? Everything, so. Yeah, that's what they say. Just go rent a bike and Yeah, get really, right? Team and then... Just go buy a bike. Oh, <laughs> well, yeah. One third the price. Exactly. Just go buy a bike, show up, drill some holes and go ride it. You're good to go. Yeah, that's pretty funny. <laughs> no, I mean, I've ridden Phillip Island and Spa, Misano, Mugello. Catalonia, uh, Bruno. Where's that? Czech Republic. Oh wow, that's awesome. <laughs> been a little bit over, huh? Yeah. And only here they make you put patches on your leathers. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> welcome, welcome to my world, Monster World. <laughs> hey, what did he say? Like, the camera is here, welcome to my world. <laughs> Why not? Are you doing the whole national circuit? Well, I just can't afford it. Uh, Kawasaki is paying me nothing. And, uh, give him some more money, Kawasaki. Hey, Monster, give him some money. <laughs> yeah.
time Into fist of fury No no Give my love to you But you know I've done what 